face what's left The songs we chase are leading us And love is all we'll ever trust Yeah, no, I don't wanna waste what's left And love we're back with season six episode 30 of genshin impact anyways let's get into the game because so much soon it's a little time to do so all right it's been almost close to two weeks since the last episode and we have made some progress here and there with leveling up the characters to level 90 and such and getting their artifacts more powered up and uh numerous things here and there uh but before i continue there's two things i need to talk about real quick uh to actually address two things from the end of last episode which actually no i actually have to go back and rewatch a little bit of the last episode just to remember this because i completely forgot that i had to uh, uh talk about these few different things thankfully though i already looked this stuff up a while back back whenever 
you know, I finished uh, last episode, but still, I just, I completely forgot how to talk about it. So, uh, at the end of the last episode, I had uh, said that I, whoops, that I would look into this and the damage numbers as to why they were different, okay? Well, the one, I'm an idiot, <laughs> as usual. I, whoops, that's, hold on. This one I should have known, but I'm not used to it because I don't normally ever have two fire, uh, two, you know, two pyro characters on the team at the same time, but it's actually part of the elemental re, uh, renaissance or whatever you say. Uh, affected by crowd for 40% less time and increases attack by 25%. So right there, if you have two pyro characters on your team at the same time, uh, you get additional attack damage. So as we can see right here, uh, 2,527, 1,757, okay, now if we do this, whoops, I shouldn't have, well, no, that makes sense, uh, instead of 1,700 something, now it's 1,570, and then the other one, Instead of 2,500, whatever it was, uh, now it's 2,341. Now, the same thing would apply to the other two characters as well. Uh, so we have 1,704, 2,035. Okay, now if I rotate... 2,234 instead of 2,000... 30, whatever it was. Either way, it was 2-0 something. <laughs> now it's 2-2-34. Two, two, uh, this one was... 2 Wait, this one didn't go up that much. Wasn't that 1-7? Was now it's 1-8. This one didn't go up that much. Was it 1-7? Was it 1-8? Got a job for me? Come with me. <sighs> I trust you. Whoops. Yeah, one seven oh four and then one eight. Oops. I got your boss. Seventy eight. Yeah, so that that one we're still. <laughs> Uh, I mean, yeah, the other ones are probably the same, same ordeal, but it's just that the other ones you do see like two numbers difference. Whereas this one, uh, we're only seeing one number difference on the second number. Anyways, okay, so that's explained there. So that's that. The other thing I was going to explain is this. So in order to unlock this, you literally have to be doing the quest that I've been doing, this, this world quest. Uh, I don't remember which one it was now. Oh, uh, there it is. That one. Yeah, so the part one and part two, you have to do. And then once you're done with all that, then it supposedly unlocks this area. So we've actually been doing the right thing for a change, you know, working on this. That way we can finally get this, this unlocked because this is very annoying having this little locked area here in the middle of the map. It's just, yeah, it's annoying. Uh, anyways, I don't remember if I showed the last episode, or wait, no. Was this, was this 100%? I don't think it was. I think this was still 98%. Uh, but anyways, now it is 100%, so Inazuma is now completely done in terms of the map percentages, that is. Uh, so yeah, there's that. And then, what else between then and now? Uh, I've probably made some progress somewhere, but I don't know where. <laughs> oh, uh, what I do know is that... If I can go here... Okay, as you can see at the bottom of the screen, one day and 22 hours remaining on the current battle pass. And same thing would go for the wishes here. Oh, wait, no, I take it back. No, we're supposed to be following the wishes. I'm an idiot. All right. Ignore the one, <laughs> ignore the one day. No, look at the, the three days, nine hours and 56 minutes. After that, 
We're gonna get finally get the next upgrade or not upgrade. What am I saying? Upgrade update. Okay, so right now I am on version. That'll be right here. 3.5. Okay, we're on 3.5 right now, which I know there's another spot to check this, but I keep forgetting where. Uh, but yeah, we're on 3.5 right now, and in just three days, we're going to be at 3.6. And the reason why I'm pointing this out is because we're going to get another new piece of the map uh, in 3.6. Which, now, I normally stay away from the leaks because they're normally wrong. Uh, like, for example, uh, there, there's been some leaks that keep saying every every update that they're going to bring back the character Eula, and then every update comes back, it's like, uh-uh, nope, nope, nope. So, yeah, I, I don't I don't follow leaks at all. However, this time, because of the fact we're so close, and this time it involved a map, I thought, eh, why don't I look it up, see, see what I can find, you know, see if there's anything on the map, just to give me an idea, even if it's not accurate, just give me an idea. And the, the leak that I saw on this one website showed that the new area is supposed to be right here. Alright, now, of course, take that with a grain of salt. We won't know until the next update, because uh, Genshin Impact's devs have not, have not actually shared publicly what where the, the new area is supposed to be. Now, they did show some screenshots of the area them uh, of the area itself, okay? But they just, they just didn't show it map-wise. However, whenever I saw that it was supposed to be this area here, I kind of went to the spot and took some screenshots and stuff, which actually, just give me a second, let me bring them up. Okay. Um, when I went to the location, as you can see in this picture here, well, I have uh, several pictures here. Um... This definitely does look like this could definitely be the next area. Because the end of the map is literally just right in front of my character here. Not that far. I mean, you can see up the top left uh, part of the screen. You can see around the map. Literally, it ends right there. However, when we zoom in, which, let me... Okay, well, this was actually zoomed out. This was uh, <laughs> trying to get more of the image. Um, of course, they're showing the location. Here. Here's where I was talking about. Zoomed in, we can actually see there's some stuff out there. So, it kind of supports the idea that this definitely will be the next area. You know, go, well, it's going to go farther than, you know, it's going to go uh, off to the right, supposedly. Because actually, that's even how it was in the in, in the leak image. Um, I, I, I want to show, but at the same time, I don't want to show because just I don't know if that was accurate. But anyways, I'm just saying that this is where... It's supposed it might be. So, um, here's some image. So, basically, we're looking at images now of before, and if this is the area, we'll have to make sure to really look at this place later on uh, after the update, if it does change here, and see how different it is. So, he, this, sadly, a sandstorm came in, and no matter what I did, I tried to advance time over and over and over. I just couldn't get rid of the sandstorm, and I didn't have enough time to wait it out. So, these next two photos here are going to be in a sandstorm uh, but anyways here you can still see the area off to the left there uh, I took a more wider picture here with the the right so, uh, area up, up above so you could see how it is now just in case that's all gets reformed and then of course same here now yes I know I could just probably uh, go over there actually you know I think we will we'll, we'll still fast travel over there anyways but it's just, I wanted to get these photos in because I didn't know if I was going to get the next Genshin Impact episode in <laughs> before the update. And yeah, I just wanted these photos. Besides, just to see uh, before and after because I never really got to do that. Uh, well, no, we kind of did it with the Chasm. Back before the Chasm came out, we did get to see a little bit of what the area looked like before. And then, of course, got to see what it looks like after. And wow, big difference. But uh, yeah. Anyways, let's get back to the game. Okay, now we're finally back, and Stay go close. figure. No going off on your own. The desert doesn't take prisoners. It's still a sandstorm. Are you kidding me? That was like that was a couple days ago. Well, a day or two. Um, but yeah. Anyways, here here we can see 
the area and then don't know how different it's going to look whenever the update comes out again if 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 this is going to be the the area oh good it's clearing up There is an enemy over here, however. Yeah. Unless I can try to quickly take him down. Oh wait, no, I don't want him to fall. See, last time he fell and it gave me a lot of trouble. Hey, over here. Really? You don't move? Well, there is a barrier right there. Yeah. So if I can just kill him real fast. Ow. There, finally. And you did. Oh, you had to go through. You jerk. Forget it. But yeah, it's, it's just, this is a bit rare getting to see an area before it gets more, uh, morphed. Again, if, if that's this spot here. Anyways, as for the actual photos that, uh, the devs shared, that I don't think I, no, I, oh, I didn't. I, that I forgot. Okay, that I'm sorry. I, I, I did actually want to grab those photos and show them, but oops. Well, you know what? They'll probably be in the preview. Uh... Whatever you call it. The thing on here, once we finally get updated on here. Which actually, wait, wait, wait. Maybe they did put it up here. Want to update summary? Uh... Oh, here. Is this it? No, that's not it. Is it this one? No. Oh, well that... This is so stupid. I can't actually view this from here. Like, if I, here, like, watch. If I do this, it's going to bring up a QR code. Well, it did. It's supposed to be right here. Normally, honestly, normally it's there. I don't know why it's not there all of a sudden. Maybe the thing's down. I don't know. Uh, but, yeah, it's like, uh, excuse me, why don't you just link me to the page? Stop with this QR crap. Yeah, okay, so I can't show it from here. <sighs> That's stupid. That really stupid. No way I can get a nap in this hotel. Well, anyways, uh, hopefully by next episode, <laughs> we'll be able to see the photos and see the new area and and just... Get, whoa! Okay, 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 I'm moving! Wait. Okay, now I'm moving! Sorry! Calm down! Good gosh. Alright, well, anyways, in terms of what I was talking about earlier about updating the character or upgrading the characters... Uh, so Yelan, her friendship's now level, uh, level 10, as you can, I, well, actually, wait, did you see this? Yeah, yeah, up at the top there, that's her, uh, name card she'll give you. So, yeah, with the dice, so you probably already spawned that. Uh, but anyways, in terms of level, I actually just got her level 90 just about maybe an hour ago before, uh, for this. And Yenfei and Yemiko, uh, these two, within the past few days, I was able to finally get them up to level 90. Uh, Dea is still level 80, sadly. And everybody else is still pretty much the same as from last time, other than the fact that with the artifacts, uh, my main team right now is all... Oh wait, no, I take it back. No, I'm still working on her last artifact there. Um, yes, yeah, so anyone I'm still working on in terms of the main current team. But everyone else is, uh, maxed out in terms of the, you know, all the gold artifacts. But now in terms of the, the secondary team, the ones I use here and there, um, for special cases, yeah, as you can see, she still needs her artifacts leveled up. Uh, same thing with Barbara. Uh, same thing with, uh, Raiden. That one. Oh, wait, no! 
Oh, wait. No, I take that back. I must have just finished Raiden. Mm, I must have... Okay, I must... Wow, I, I completely forgot about that. I've been going all over the place here, so I, I thought I still had one more left, but nope. Okay, Raiden's done for now. And Tarkin Vine should get her a five-star for that. But, uh, yeah, the current one I'm working on right now is... Yay, Miko, which actually, of all out of all the ones, this one's the kind of, like, very important because <laughs> electro damage bonus, yeah. Uh, I would have been able to get it up to at least level 17, but the problem is I ran out of money. I'm poor in this game now. Oh, wait, no, I have some, Wait, how did I get some money? Oh, was it the, um... The, the daily... Ha! <laughs> Bear with me here. Just just bear with me. Uh, yeah, the daily commissions gave me enough money there. I didn't realize that. Okay, there we go. Yeah, now, honestly, when I was doing it earlier, I was literally down to 500-something gold, and I have been struggling so much to keep uh, money, you know, and I'm just, it's just trying to level up my current characters and stuff, and level everything up, it's just been drawing all of the resources. Alright, so anyways, the last episode I did say I wanted to check out this place real quick. See if anything's different. Or maybe not. I think it is officially done, because it has been some time. Rats. Now that's, of course, the incense from last time. Uh, let's grab some more. There we go. Unless I'm supposed to light that for X amount of days, because, see, I've not been coming over here. <laughs> Uh, maybe I'm supposed to continue with this. You know, I'll have to Google that. So, yeah, we won't be back here until either if I find out more information that we can continue this or... Wait, where'd go? Oh, there he is. Or, um, we're just officially done here. I don't know. Like I said, I would like to see it continue, but who knows. Uh, what else, what else, what else, what else did I say we were supposed to look at? I know at the end of the last episode, I just, I remember saying, let's continue the main thing here, and let's do this. So basically, in terms of the last episode, I think I've shown and talked about everything by now. Yeah. But I could oh, I know what, okay. So this happened between episodes. I really wanted to show this, because this is kind of very important. I finally, 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 about a week ago, or less, uh, finally completed the fifth Whispers in the Wind uh, Daily Commission in Mondstadt. And I, I just wanted to point this out, because a long, long time ago, I, I remember talking about this. And it definitely took a long time. Of course, now, it wasn't helping whenever I had the data commissions in other regions, of course. Yeah, it wasn't helping at all because it wasn't doing anything. So anyways, uh, this past few months I switched it back to Mondstadt and then finally got the last of the requirements for that. So finally, finally, finally got that done. But yeah. So I just wanted to show that. Uh, what else? 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 I think we're good. I think we can now continue the quest. If I've forgotten anything, I am sorry. I tried my best.
Oh no. Oh, I tr I accidentally triggered this by walking too close to it. I didn't know that was going to happen. I still wish I knew what this original human that they uh, came across, like who was it? Just walk by the others real quick, just to see if anything triggers. I'm not gonna click on them. I just need to make sure nothing's gonna trigger. Okay, that one's good. Ah, see. Okay, this one triggered. Either I accidentally went over the treasure map, or I don't, we don't have a treasure map. I don't... Wait, 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 wait. 
No. I was gonna say, may wait a minute. Oh no. Okay, no. There it is. I thought that was being added with what we're currently doing. I got a new letter from an informant. Shown in the painting. Has changed again. What painting? I didn't see no painting. Is it somewhere else? Wouldn't be there. Wouldn't be there. No, it has to be on that one page. This one. Oh, great. Painting, painting, painting. Uh, I don't see a painting. I'm gonna have to go through every single one of these items. I vaguely remember this. Oh! Here's the painting! Wow, that took a while. been so long since I've done this. I don't remember how to... Oh, wait a minute. Nope, it just came back to me. See, this is the one thing I never understood. Which is... How do I know which... version I'm in? If that makes any sense. Whoa. Oh. That might do it. <laughs> See, last time I did this, it didn't switch the sky. I'm pretty sure that was on uh, in during an episode. Oh wow, we can see that for oh that's cool. Well, even though once we ever do that uh, Samara quest over there, we won't see that anymore. Which I'm still ticked about that. I mean, I've gotten used to seeing that. And it's just so neat. Originally, it was so spooky. But anyways, wow, it's so beautiful here. Wait, uh, can we still see the little critters? Ah, oh, we can't see them anymore. I 
I wonder... Oh, wow. Oh, it's kind of laggy all of a sudden. Now that is just perfect. The lighting, just everything about that is just absolutely whoa. I just wish I can get the stupid user ID crap off. Um, oh, there we go. Mysterious mailbox in this location. Exploration knowledge. Uh, okay. Show up an image you find. Huh. Easy money. Now, oh. Do I have to be in the other realm to see the mailbox stuff and then switch back to reality? Because if so, that's going to get really annoying. Have to keep flip, flipping back and forth like that. Oh, look, it's actually glowing. Static views complete. Is this a daily reset thing or what? Wait, wasn't this on the top row before? Whoa! Okay, so I know where that is. I know where that is. Well, kind of. I mean, I know we've been there, but I can't remember. Oh, wait, no. I I think I now know exactly where that's at. Okay, this. I have an idea where it's at, because of course you can see the thing, the, the blue stuff in the background. Yeah, obviously, but uh, the very pinpoint location, not sure. Uh, this is actually right next to us. Right? Wait, is that the same place just on the reverse side? That could be anywhere. That's going to be a problem trying to locate that one. That one, I think I know where that's at. Oh, come on. No, there's no way. There's no way I'm gonna, I can find that one. That one I'm probably going to have to use a guide for. I don't remember ever seeing anything like that in Samaru. Unless that's under the new area that we haven't gone to yet. Well, when I say new area, the locked area. Wow. The worst part is I'm going to forget about this and then not look for these treasures. The one I'll, I'll try to get right now. No, this, it can't be this one. The house is too big. Yeah, and there's no branching... Okay, no, this is not it. Where 
is that at? Water, house. I don't know. I don't think I've seen that before. Anything that resembles it is just where we're at right now. Oh, dig. Treasure. Um, when they placed that there, by any chance, was this thing not here at the time? What did I just do? I have no- oh. Whoa, what? Whoa. Weather control activated. Oh, that's right. This thing allows me to control the weather. Whoa! All right. What? What about um? This blinding sunlight is such a pain. No way I can get a nap in this weather. Oh, 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 okay. So, if I click the one I just clicked, that means it goes back to default. As in, whatever it's supposed to be doing whenever. Okay.
We still need access to this one. Wait, am I in the right place? That's where we came from. Oh. We need to go this way. Take it easy. Nope. Uh-uh. Nope. Just nope. 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 Oh, wait a minute. This is taking me out of here. Are you kidding me? Alright. How... Oh, no, 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 no. Crap. How did we get in here last time? I remember that we went to this location. I hate this. This was only last episode for everyone else, but for me, like I said, it's been uh, just under two weeks and I don't remember. Oh, this sucks. Um, this is on. Maybe this was just one of the locations we went to, and it was maybe somewhere else where we went to the one thing. Oh, for crying out loud. Alright, I'll be right back. I'm gonna go <laughs> uh, watch through the last episode and find out where I went to get to that area. So, BRB. I'm an idiot. As usual. I goofed this up big time. Here we go. <laughs> uh, yeah, okay, so to get to this, we have to actually go down into the giant uh thing, shell, whatever this thing is that's in the, yeah, I'm shutting up. Did it, didn't, wait, didn't it say it was right here? No, it's near... Oh, wait, maybe inside. Aha! Well, what do we have here? Yes, I got one theory for that, 
And I think we can maybe find that. But the, the other ones, I'm going to have to look up a guide and probably have to end up doing it off camera. I'm still hoping for the day we'll eventually see one of these things in action. In the map. Live. And again, I'm not talking about the ones that are slightly activated, buried. I'm talking like a full, standing one, uh... If there actually was one, I could actually see it in like Sne 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 I always have trouble. Sneznea. You know, the military, uh, region. That's where I would totally, I could totally see one of them being. That would be cool. Well, that or Fontaine, since that one's all mechanical. Yeah. Actually, you know what? No, you know, it would actually probably make more sense at Fontaine then. I, I don't know. You know what? It's either with the military region, Cisnea, or uh, the mechanical Fontaine. And we're supposed to get Fontaine this year, so... I'm still hoping Fontaine's going to be something like uh, the mechanical city in Nino Kuni. I know, wishful thinking. Uh, oh, I didn't say the full title. Nino Kuni: Wrath of the White Witch. Yeah. If you ever played that game or saw the game, there's a mechanical city in there, and that is what I, I would like to see. What the hell? I just pick up. Uh, that's what I'd like to see as Fontaine in this game, but I, I know. It, it's just wishful thing. It's, it's, I, I shouldn't even be wish, wishing that because we know it's not going to look anything like that. Now, what in the world? Oh, I grabbed that. Yeah. Still got to figure that out. Uh, I must be in the wrong location. Yeah, the, the surrounding area does not exactly match up. Oh, wait, 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 wait. There is this thing here. Is there water behind this? Yes, there is. No, this is it! Then wait, where's it at? Um, game? Reveal to me your secrets. Okay, so it's right next to the jump pad. To the left of it. Where's the jump pad? Jump pad, jump here. So, it should be right here? I'm not seeing it. Is there... Let's see, we got the thing sticking out of the ground. See, this is going to be a different one. Because a lot of this does not match up. <laughs> Which is, this is the only one that I'm aware of. Okay, right now we're inside the giant, uh... Well, we're, okay, no, I take it back. We're not inside it. I mean, we're inside, like, the cave where the thing's at.
See, there's another one of those things, but I don't think this is it. No, there's no water behind it. And there's no bounce pad. Apparently I forgot about that thing. That or I tried it and I didn't complete it. No, you know what? There's still a lot I need to do. Well, I haven't really actually worked on Samaru that much anyways, so... I've been busy on all the other regions. Which, like I said in last episode, just only just recently completed all the other regions. And between last episode and this episode, I've been actually more busy with... Just trying to focus on getting my characters um, upgraded. Oh wait, are we inside the machine? I actually can't remember now. I almost think we are. Alright, I give up for now. <laughs> wow. High difference. Uh, where is there? And... Let's get back on the main path here. Wait, what? This is like right ne near me. Considering. What is this? I guess we're gonna work My on this part next. Used to the desert life, but still, I hope that one day they'll be able to find an oasis of. Okay, is there gonna be a quicker way than have to climb that? Okay, this might work. I like how we've done so much, but yet I have had no progress in this episode whatsoever. Can't help it. I like these things. <laughs> I'm getting distracted. I've done a few of these already. Wait. Why did some of them not... I don't know.
call dibs. It's a good thing we came <laughs> over here, because I think this one ones we need to collect, right? Yes. All right, that's another one we're supposed to collect. Good. Yeah, so it, it's, like I said, it's a good thing we came over here, because I need to collect all them, and I don't even know where they're all at. I don't know which ones we've done. It's really, really annoying. So anytime I spot one, gotta grab it. And whoa, what the hey is going on here? Uh, whoa, what? Oh, no, I'm making make matters worse. Another one. Maybe after we uh, take down the rest of these little things, uh, that maybe the shield might go down. That worked. so neat it just it ticks me off that once we complete all or collect all these then that's it won't be able to see these in the world ever again that's why I'm what I'm hoping for is maybe at the end of the game like once they do the final area that they'll have like one of each of those things in a uh, in, in some kind of room where they're on display, you can always see them. Because the thing is that after you complete a region, you still have one left over. So like once I eventually complete Sumeru, I'm gonna have one Dendro Oculus left. So like I'm saying, it would be really really cool to be able to put these in like the museum or whatever place so we can always see them wherever that is. Now, my personal hope is that by having one of each of these will allow you to get into, I can't see it on the screen. Let's see, that's north, should be over this way. Wait, why do I not see it? Is there a cloud in front of it? Uh, this is this is kind of wacky. I can't see the no 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 wait wait no it's gotta be north it's, it has to be north of me. Well, I don't want to teleport right now because I don't want to lose my spot. But the floating there is that it? Yeah, you can just barely see it. It's right there, but I gotta like put the screen over. I gotta put the. Yeah, screen like that so you can see it to the to the left. Yeah, that place. I'm hoping, what I'm hoping is that, and I'm pretty sure I've said this before in the past, that once you have at least like one of every Oculus, you know, Dendro Oculus, Anemo Oculus, you know, all the different Oculuses, all seven I guess in this case, yeah. Once you have all seven, then like maybe you can finally go to that place and then there will be like maybe a barrier 
that requires you to pay one of each of these oculuses, if I can say it like that, um, <laughs> and then it'll allow you to get through. That is my hopes and dreams for that. Okay, I was gonna pass this up, but... You know, they're asking for it. Wait a minute. Um, am I supposed to deal with this guy? That name looks awfully familiar. Oops, wrong character. Oh, that was one of those little events. Oh. Now, what's going to happen if I grab all these? <laughs> Is something going to happen? Oh, wait, I can't grab them. Never mind. Screw that. Oh. There's one back here. It's kind of bugging me a little bit. Should be up in that tree, right? Yep, there it is. Wait, roses floating. 
Are they floating? No. Then, what, what was that all about? They just said there was roses floating in the air. Music. I need to get music. Come on. No. That. There. Now I. Get, different perspectives. Oh. 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 Well, we still might need this anyways. Okay. So let's see. If we were going to go on the ABC system. Uh, let's see, or one, two, three, whichever way you want to say it. So, this one looks a little bit lower than that. This one looks on par with this. So, let's say one, and this is a one. So, it's one, three, four, two, one. 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 One, three, four, Okay, so then we want to start with that one over there. One, three, there. Even though I could have just maybe just circled around the thing and not paid attention to the actual picture on the rock. Finally! Oh my gosh. I found some of these flowers over time. I only marked one of them, though. Uh, which I actually did show in a previous episode. I don't remember if it was the last episode or the episode before. But I do remember showing that flower at some point. And, yeah. Finally got the rhythm for that. Alright, now is there one nearby here? Uh, what?
Okay, I lost the trail. There. And I lost the trail again. Oh, for crying out loud. Oh, I just now looked at the minimap. Minimap was giving it away. Thanks a lot, minimap. All right, so what's it causing to disappear? Oh. What the? Okay, my mind just exploded. Whoa. Wait, how did it do that with the sun? Oh, it must be in the area we're in. It's, it's darkening. Okay. Uh, I need that. Ow. Double owl. <clears throat> oh, I did it again. Okay, things are getting creepy, because that thing over there, uh, above the character's head, looks a lot like the... Oh, and we're all the way over here, wow. Um, looks like the stuff that's over here. Um, I feel like an idiot right now, but was this like this before? Curved in? I thought this was straight down before. I'm gonna have to look at old footage to see. Uh, no, I don't remember being like. That. I think that literally just. Wait, then can you by any chance please pull this one back too? Because that'd be great. Because that just looks really weird, going like that. Is there a... Yes, there is. This is super spooky. Got it. 
Now, where is the other... Whoa! Oh, I forgot to move. Where's the other one? It is there. Somewhere's... Oh! Whoops. Aha! Oh. Take it easy. Get the line. Right now. Thumbs up. Yeah. Gotcha. Oh, I need to shoot that thing. Er, maybe not. Oh, wait, no, I think... Whoops. I think without that one, I think I just need to... Interact with it. Yep, there it is. Full of valuables and a trove of potential clues. Uh, give me a minute, just in case this puts us somewhere else. I need just quickly search the area, make sure we didn't miss any, any anything. Okay, I don't see anything else, so... Oh, that's kind of cool. Paimon's actually right here, out in the open. Oh, now this is rare. Getting to see Paimon... Uh, well, in free, uh, free gameplay like this. 
Here, we'll just leave the quest right here, and that way Paimon will be stuck right here. <laughs> I know, that's cruel. But anyways, I want to get a better look at this cape. If I can get close on the cape. No, 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 I want to close up on the cape. Here, do it this way, and then... The desert's a it almost looks like a reflection. But at least it doesn't hide anything. What you see is what you get. And whether you take on the challenge is entirely up to you. Like it's try like it's maybe like the water reflecting the stars. Cause this is always unique how how her cape is, and it's always wondered how that works. But yeah, technically it is supposed to be like the night sky. Really neat. Too bad we couldn't get a cape like that. Paimon, you're lucky to have a cape like that. Also, another thing about Paimon is... What's with the floating crown thing above her head? Do we know of any other characters that have that? I mean, there probably is, and I just never really pay attention. Well, in terms of the playable characters, no. In terms of the enemies... Well... They're kind of floating above, but they're not a crown, though. Wait, so would this, would this mean that Paimon is from the place that got destroyed 500, 5,000 years ago, whatever it was? Because aren't these guys supposed to be from the same place? And they have floating things above their head. Well, kind of above their heads. Oh, look! <laughs> you can still see our Paimon. Oh, no. There's, there's two Paimons now. <laughs> <laughs> Paimon versus Paimon. That's nutty. Well, it, it just, this is so weird. Seeing Paimon outside of, like, either this or outside of the cutscenes or the interactions. Actually, in playable. Well, yes, you can get Paimon in playable area at the tea house. Or, tea house. Teapot, yes. But I'm saying, like, in the open world, the overworld, the, you know, main game. Um, this is just so, so unique. Also, in the fact that in the teapot, I have her in the house. And I can't use in, um, the, the zoom. I can't use gadgets inside the house, you know, to look at the cave. And then actually where I even have her, I just can't even really... Maybe I should move her outside. Oh wait, no, I can't because of the space problem. Yeah. Anyways, goodbye, Paimon. It was nice seeing you out in the open. That Actually, that is one thing that kind of ticks me off. That we can't have her out in the open. You know? It's like she's supposed to be traveling with us, okay? Well, since we can have, like, these pets... Why can't we choose Paimon as, like, a pet to have... I'm saying feature. Feature. Pet. You know, feature. I'm not saying her as a pet. <laughs> it came out wrong. But, no, I'm saying, like, since we have this feature, we can have these 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 pets, these summons, these whatever you want to call them. Wait, wait, wait. Where is it? It should be... Here, what is, what's the game called? It was a... It's Gadget. Uh, yeah, for the most part, just 
it, well, because they're all gadgets, but... Yeah, why can't Paimon be set as a gadget so we could have her traveling with us and stuff? That would be so cool. And actually, it would make more sense, you know, to the game since she's supposed to be with us all the time. And they could easily set her up like the current uh, gadget pets we have where she vanishes whenever we go into combat. I mean, it's already built in the game. They just need to put her as one of the gadgets. Boom. There. Okay, that just vanished. Whoa. Whoa! Wow. Hold up. Wait, 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 wait. No, we're not over there. Are we? Supposedly there's a place that we're supposed to go to at some point. I don't know if it's the place that's coming in the next update. Where... It's a timeless place where time doesn't move. So, like, you can see, like, animals and other things, like, just not moving. Oh, no, I don't want to leave. I'm guessing I can't use the, uh, this thing? Oh, I can, okay. I wonder why they put stuff out there if we're not supposed to go out there. Or maybe we can go out there, and I'm just jumping the gun here. Because, I mean, there is a big doorway right here. <laughs> uh, yeah. Oh. Oh, I didn't get a good enough look at that. I'm sorry. Wait, so we're going to go through there, but we can't leave through there. Wait, that's shown above. Oh, okay, I think I get it. Uh, what's with the, the light show over there? Whoa, 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 that was the game. That was the game glitching out. What the hey? Um... Yeah, that wasn't the TV. That was, that was definitely the game, and I know because I saw it on the, um... Recording preview. If it was the TV, I wouldn't have seen that on the recording preview. So I'm assuming that one spot with the light is probably a glitch that caused all that. Hey, the thing we just picked up?
Yeah. Uh, the thing we just picked up looks a lot like that other thing. This thing. Lost energy block. I can't charge it. Alright, so I'm guessing at this point you ha- oh no. Um... Houston, we have a problem. I don't have any Dendro characters on the field, and a very, 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 very stupid idiotic system will not let me uh, change to a Dendro character to activate this thing. Because some idiot thought it was okay to uh, not allow us to change in this particular domain when you need a Dendro character. So basically I have to, I'm guessing, exit out, flip to a Dendro character and redo this whole bloody thing. Please tell me there's a way I can get through. That's an invisible wall. Maybe I can climb- wait, maybe I can climb this part. Maybe? Ah, oh, it didn't open the, the wings up for some odd reason. Come on, stop fighting with me. Oh no. Oh no. You know, I thought we were supposed to have smart devs here. That was supposed to understand if something like this would happen. Where, you know, you go into a domain without the proper character. Because it didn't say at the beginning of this that I need a Dendro character. Please tell me I can use this one gadget. This is my only hope. Oh, thank you. Oh, that's a relief. That's why I always gotta keep this thing charged. Never know when I'm gonna need it. Oh, now you give me this thing! Wait, I didn't even think it was gonna work on that. Will it? Oh, oh, look at that. It did. 
Thanks, idiot devs, for putting the thing in the wrong place. Wait, where'd it go? Wait, grab this just in case. a big flower and more fungi I'm kind of sad we didn't get to go to that giant uh, plant we saw. I mean, yeah, we did get to go to this giant plant, but that other one we saw in the other spot. I was really hoping we could have seen that. I mean, I barely saw it. Okay, this is kind of weird. Normally when you complete domains like this, a chest will appear. And it didn't. That's a little odd. Can I climb up? Nope. Invisible wall. Wow. I hate invisible walls. From what I could tell, this domain here, not much work was done on it. I feel like they rushed that domain. Wait, pick up what? What am I picking up?
Wait, so now I have to find the rest of those flowers? Problem, I only know where one of them is. Okay, I'm not sure why I just switched, because we're going to go right to the other flower, so... As soon as I get some health... Oh, hey, since if this was opened up like this, I wonder if that means we can explore the upper part. How much closer do I need to get? Yeah, I don't even think I've been over here before. Yeah, because see, with Samara, I've not been every single spot unlike the other regions where I've pretty much seen everything. That is not what I was aiming for. Why does it keep going with that one? Uh, game? No, that's not the one I... Okay, what is going on here? Game! Are you kidding me? I'm literally hitting this one. And it goes that one. Is this buggy or something? Am I missing something here? Yeah, let's get in, in its path. There, finally. Watch, well, kind of get. Yep, I knew it. Went back to that one. Man, it's annoying. Oh my god, and it still went to... <laughs> Finally, got it. Dancing enemies. Hi. Bye. Is that in Azuma?
the hey is that? It's gotta be Inazuma. It is this island here, it seems. Oh yeah, I can see. Okay, the if we can, if you can look basically right there, dead center. All right, I'm gonna now move it over to the side here so you can see it better. Uh yeah, that particular spot, I know exactly where that's at. But the thing that's throwing me off right now is there's like this little thing right there, and we're losing light. Oh, there we go. Now, we, oh, now we can see. <laughs> Maybe I should make it nighttime. <laughs> Hey, how was I supposed to know? Yeah, there's the other islands. The waterfall spot there is really neat. And I'm still hoping and waiting... For the day they'll ever give us like a little island to explore uh, that's actually connected to the mainland. Not separate like over there, but based on what we're seeing right here. Right there. Right, right, right what you're seeing. But yet, probably we'll never get to explore something like that. We're probably going to just wipe all that out. Apparently it's like right here. Which actually begs the question, will we ever get to play in this... This area here, will this ever be playable map? And then if so, will this ever become a bridge to where we can actually travel between there and here? Because before, it was always this imaginary storm that was always blocking us, even though, of course, it was, you know, to stop us once you get far enough and then teleport us back. Um, you know, we could never go here. But I'm just wondering, like, will this ever be open to where I can take a, maybe a, a one of those little boats... Wave Rider, and take it from, say, there to here? Because, see, what I'm hoping for is that since this seems to be the open ocean down here, I would love to be able to take a Wave Rider here and just sail out, but I guess that will never happen. See, that's one thing that really irritates me about this game, is that we're only allowed to use the Wave Riders in select spots, mainly, in this case, just in Inazuma. We can't use the Wave Rider, uh, well, yes, there is also some select, uh, spots on the rivers and stuff in, uh, Sumeru, yes. But, we can't use the Wave r Rider here in all this open water in, uh, the first two zone, uh, regions. Which is very aggravating, because there's actually a... What was it? It was, um... There was one of those timed events where we were actually able to use the Wave Rider around this area, but it was limited. We can only go, like, within a certain distance, and that was it. That was so fun. I wish they could have left that in there. But now... Let's take out, uh... Hard work huh. that, that some roll. dev worked on. Right. Let's just take it out of the game, because... <laughs> Knock out the rest of the work once I'm feeling up. Oh, hey, you want to add something fun? No, let's get it. It's pulled out of the game. Oh, we're going to add something new? Nope. Got to pull it out of the game, too. Can't have anything new in here. Nope, nope, nope. I will never understand that mentality. The, the uh, whoever it is that makes the decisions for this game. Pulling stuff out. So stupid. Um, where are we going? Where's that at? Up there. Okay. Uh, where's the flower I found? There. Yeah, musical flower. Bingo. 
Let's hit up this. Well, wait, 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 wait. Is is one of the locations that? Let's try this one. Uh, nope. But close. Uh, okay. Uh, yeah, we can't do that one at the moment. Let's just undo that, and then let's go to the musical flower I found. Yeah, taken out is just like, like say, Summertime Aussie. You know, people worked on that stuff. They created that amazing map, that amazing island that could transform into other places and stuff. It was so cool. But no, 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 no. Some higher up decided, nah, we're going to make this limited time and then nobody else is going to get to experience it ever again. That's why the higher ups, they need whoever makes the decisions, they need to have stuff taken off of them. See how they like it. Yet then again, they probably wouldn't mind because they have the mindset of wait, what happened? Oh, that was, wait, that was it. Hold on. Wait, we're done with this? You're kidding. Um, they could probably lose everything and be totally fine. Yeah, that kind of mindset. Uh, are we done with this spot? It just basically revealed a couple enemies and that was it. Uh, game, you're killing me. I'm gonna have to put a note on this saying- whoops, wrong button. Uh, musical flower... Oh wait, how do I- here we go. Completed question mark? There we go. That way that'll remind me. And jump. I gotta land over here in case of the game gonna try to stop me. Yeah, like right there, right there. I, I would have tried to pull the pull the um the wings, and the game probably been like, nope, you're not allowed to pull the wings right now. Oh, hey, it's another one of those.
You know what? I'm not even going to look. Nope. I'm not even looking because, like I said last time, I think what we can just do is just w walk around it. See? Yeah, all I did was just walk around it and eventually it it gave it to us. Yes, finally. This is the one I've been wanting to get. My people are used to the desert life, but still, I hope that one day they'll be able to find an oasis of their own and leave the sandstorms behind for a better life. The very According spot to some that... of the older Aramites, it does actually rain in the desert on occasion, and when it does, it's always a lot heavier than this. This is actually the very spot I showed, uh, whatever episode that was, X amount of episodes ago, could have been last episode, could have been episode four. I don't remember, but I remember showing this just recently. Uh, even though there's other spots where I know this has been, but yeah, this this it's funny that it took us to this spot that I showed. I was personally hoping that it would have taken us to the other spot. Since I can't remember where it's at. Wave? Wait, 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 what? A wave rider? What? You're kidding me. Oops. Wow, coincidence. I'm literally just talking about the wave rider, and then now <laughs> this part has the wave rider. Oh my god. Gosh! 
That coincidence. Anyways, I can't read anything that's going on at the bottom of the screen, so I have no idea what they're talking about. Oh no. Oh, I've hit a dead end. No! Okay, that was a little weird. You know what? This whole section's very weird. Yeah, I can see why we have the wave rider because trying to swim th swim through all this would not have been good. So, what do I do? I go right into it! Oh. Got it. Wasn't sure if I was going to be able to make that shot. Now I'm going to assume that there's nothing to grab here, no chests to collect. But I'm still looking anyways. Yeah, we're good. I'm on start just start putting in your head that the corruption is everywhere that way you won't be surprised when you finally see some more corruption okay Paimon yeah, she keeps saying that all the time oh I didn't know it's gonna be here too it's like um oh no I missed something Right over there. Whoops.
Okay, in a moment. Oh! How did I miss this? Oh, whoops. I don't even know how that thing got out there. Is there an explanation for this? As to why this is all the way down here? This will probably be the last thing we'll do for this episode. Oh, there's that thing again! Oh, wait a minute. Is that by any chance the same thing that's over... ...here? Isn't there like something over here that's... ...it looks like the same thing? You know, in a way, it actually looks like a completed version of this, of the thing that sits here. Hmm. Yeah, it's a really good thing I brought a an archer with us on this this trip. I have no idea if that was supposed to be a certain culmination or not. Because I, I don't think I hit the one on this side. On the right. Whoa, it's an elevator. <gasps> Whoa!
That was neat. We finally got to see it. It's just floating, or well, it's on a platform just floating. You know what? What's funny is that the platform itself almost looks like something we've seen in uh, the desert version of Samaru. Show them. Emerge. Quietly now. Basically, what I'm referring to there would be, like, this stuff right here. All these, like, rocks and stuff. Um, this is weird. Look for the objective in this area, but I was standing in it and just wouldn't let me pick it up yet. Sorry about that. I don't normally record this time of the day. <laughs> yeah. But hey, once in a rare blue moon, accidents happen and record a certain point of the day that, oh no, the phone has rung. All right, well anyways, um, I definitely need to chime in back in now because right here they're finally talking about the, um, well, they're calling a giant purple tree uh, in, in the dream, but that, that's what we kept looking at. This is almost sound a little bit like Avatar. <laughs>
Okay, I think from here we can just... Oh, hold on. Definitely need to grab them, and since some stuff just appeared, I'm wondering if that means there's anything around here. Uh, what? Did they go in the water? I guess they did. Quick, push in the water. There we go. <laughs> that worked. Goodbye to this place. Where is the next location so I know? Uh, well, uh, mm -hmm, uh, game. Where is that at, though? <laughs> How am I supposed to know? Yeah, I don't know. Well, it said it's nearby. Let, let's try something real quick here. It says it's closer. How the... Oh, and if I click it from here, then... Yeah, okay, that doesn't help. I need to follow it from... Whoops. I need to follow it from here. Okay, 8.58. Okay, yeah, so... That direction, and... Whoa. Whoa. Okay, I'm going to assume that maybe the reason why I can't click on this, or I mean get a navigational point, is because it's in that area that's locked out right now. Maybe? Or is it of over there? No, I didn't mean to hit the kitty!
Whoops. Is there another cat above me? Uh, what happened to the- oh, there it is. And how do I get up there? Can we go at that angle? Yeah, we can. Oh, now the cat's below me. Oh, the one time I don't push it to the to the right, and it's on the wrong one. Go figure. No, 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 no! You, oh, you stupid, idiotic system. No, no, mm, uh, game, game, game. I'm going away from it. Do you not see the map? Do you not see the mini-map game? Can you not see that? Look, look how I'm going away from it. Look, well, I'm okay, like, I'm, like, on a line right now. But seriously. Yeah. Ahead of us and then I have no control over my character for so long after that. This is why I can't wait to unlock the, that area so that I can stop running into that crap. Okay, 339. Is it still going down if I go in this direction? 319. Yes, it is. Oh, it's talking about this place. When you have to go in dream mode. coming up and saying dream, I kept thinking of the current dreams we've been doing. I, I totally forgot about this dream. There it is. Oh, that was the original one we were going to before I switched to the... Oh. And where's the other one? Here. Okay. Yeah, and then that's just encompassing everything else. Alright. We'll, uh, we'll work on and finish the other two, last two, whatever that is, uh, in next episode. Sadly, we did not get to make as much progress as I wanted to because I was following some other stuff like the treasure and, uh, you know, we were also doing a little bit of exploring, uh, <laughs> checking out some things, so yeah, we should have made a lot more progress and yet we didn't, I am sorry, as usual. But, uh, yeah, next episode, <laughs> I'm going to say it again, hopefully we'll make more progress in next episode. I would like for us to eventually get this thing open next episode, maybe. But, yeah, knowing my progress, eh -eh, ain't going to happen. Oh, uh, one other thing I did forget to mention earlier. Um, I did open up to... Oh, wait, no, maybe I did mention this in the last episode. Okay, if I did, I'm sorry for repeating. I just can't remember now. Uh, but there was, like, I think this spot here, and I think this one? Yeah, I think those two were still locked originally, and then I unlocked them off camera. Whereas I did all these other ones on camera. But we'll eventually see these locations, especially this one. This one is very interesting. Uh, but we'll, we'll, again, we'll eventually see all of it, because it'll have to deal with the, the, the game, the story, and all that stuff, and yada, yada, yada. Um, but, um, oh, in terms of, 
one other tiny little thing here. In terms of these things, I did manage to get a route after I said that in whatever ep episode that was. I said, oh, I need to get a route for these things, yada, yada. Well, anyways, I did find my own route. Then I did look up one on the internet that gave me, like, a full thing. that gave it, like, what, 70 or whatever it was, however many. I can't remember how many over it was. Uh, whereas, instead of following that all the time, since I don't really need these as much right now, uh, I do my own little... Whoa, I didn't mean to stand up. I do my own little personal route, I can remember, which starts right here. Basically, you just go to that, this waypoint here, you turn around, you go into a cave, and then just keep following the cave, whichever way it goes, I can't remember, uh, for quite some time, and then there's even like another spot where you drop down, and you go through it for a little bit, and um, I can get like a maximum of 25 of these things every time I do that and even though yes it's like th every three days I only get 25 I do that route but still it's getting me you know these things right now while um, I don't need them uh, instantly I mean thankfully I have enough for the next upgrade whenever that will be but yeah it's gonna be a long time since I need to get these things and those things just like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, and then if I ever need this for another character out there Eventually I'll have enough by then, but, uh, yeah. Lately I've been focusing on getting talent level up materials and once in a while money <laughs> and also been spending my resin on... this stuff here. Yeah, the uh, the weekly bosses, which are, is like, let's see, one, two, three, four, five, six. There's six weekly bosses I have to go through right now, and only three of them get halved on the, uh, the resin. So, I can spend 90 for the first three, but then the other three, wait, was it six? Yeah, 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 that and plus him. Um, then the other three have to use 60 apiece, which, that's not fun. That's basically, now, yeah, it, it's, it's ridiculous uh, how much resin I have to go through to, to do the weekly bosses. And I have to do them nowadays because I need that, uh, the, the stuff. Even though right now I can't upgrade anything because I don't have the money and don't have the, uh, or should I say, don't have the mora. <laughs> Sorry, uh, and I don't have the rest of the supplies, but I am each week, you know, building this stuff up, as we can see here. So it's it's slowly getting built. For a while, it was actually quite nice. I was getting duplicates of the wolf, or not duplicates. Um, I was getting two wolf materials. Uh, Per per week, but it only lasted for a few weeks. This week, when I did, I only got one material, which was sad. But it was actually kind of nice, though, since I haven't been able to get the wolf materials for the longest of time because my world level wasn't high enough. And just yeah, it's kind of making up for it now. But uh, I just wish I can get m multiple on the other stuff. Now, granted, I'd probably have to go at them at a higher level. But the other bosses where I need that, I can't exactly fight them at the higher levels right now. I'm not able to do that, but um, the only one last note here about the the weekly bosses. The only one I'm able to fight at level 80, because everything else is level 70. But the only one I can fight at level 80, which actually, did I try? No, did I try 90 yet? I might have tried 90. I'm not sure. Uh, which is um. Storm Terror. That one. That's the only one I can do at a higher level. I know I've done 80. I Like I said, I I can't remember if I did 90 or not. But if if I haven't, I know I'll end up doing that next time. Because uh, <laughs> Storm Terror is literally the easiest uh, weekly boss out of all of them. It is so easy. Especially with the right team. 
But even without the right team, actually, I've even recently uh, at one point even changed up the the team once. Uh, but uh, yeah, let's just say with a few of the right characters, it's it's very 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 easy and just it's amazing versus all the other weekly bosses that can be very massive pains in the neck. Like for me right now, the massive pain in the necks is. Um, the Ra uh, Raiden Shogun boss, the uh, Signora boss, and it's actually a tie between um, Child and the Geo boss because the Geo boss it's just annoying for how long it takes. Wherever things that what can oh there it is. Um, whereas Child is both easy and difficult right now for me like he can put out so much damage it's not even funny but at the same time with my team I can take him down 10 times faster than I could ever before I mean I could literally finish it within maybe I don't know if we just uh, if we don't count the uh, the cutscene maybe two minutes I, I don't know I can I can get through uh, the three stages super fast but it's just that if he hits me at all, I'm half my health gets wiped out practically, so it's really annoying. Whereas like the Geo boss, it's just annoying for how long the battle takes. It's such a lengthy battle, uh, so they would be tied. But yeah, above them would be Signora and Raiden for in terms of the hardest of them all. Well. Actually, you know, I'll probably put Signora at the top because of her, uh, the fact she changes the battlefield and it's, it's very, very, very annoying constantly have to hug the, the things that lower my heat and cold resistances and whatnot. And it's just, it's, it, yeah, her battle is very annoying. I hate doing her battle, uh, just because of that, that field part. If it wasn't because of the field... Not having to keep hugging the the four corners and stuff with Signora's battle, I you know it'd probably be a way better boss battle for me. And actually, I I probably wouldn't even complain. I probably actually say it's probably maybe an easy boss battle. But it's just that having to always hug those those four corners. Gosh, it's annoying. But yeah, that's with that. Again, one of these days, uh, like I I said this a couple seasons ago, or whatever. Someday in the future. I will take a couple episodes and we'll just go through all the bosses of the game and yeah, every single one, weekly and non-weekly, and just just show them all. And even though I think I've shown most of them so far, I think there's maybe only a couple I haven't shown. But there, those are the regular ones you can find on the map. So yeah. All right. Well, anyways, uh, that's going to be it for episode 30 of season 6 of Genshin Impact. We'll, of course, be back next time with episode 31, where we will continue more of this very, very lengthy quest to open up this area. And I'm I'm going to probably say it right now. Uh, once we unlock this area and take a little quick tour through it, I think that's when we're going to con uh, conclude season 6. Okay, so Season 6 will wrap up with us unlocking this. And then Season 7 will probably be, I guess, just getting back to the stories that we need to do. And the world quests. Yeah. Yeah, so that, that'll be Season 7. But anyways, so as for how much longer we have on Season 6, I have no idea. Because I have no idea how long it's going to take us to get through... Uh, to that area. It could be next episode, it could be the episode after, it could be even after that. Who knows, who knows, who knows. Either way, we'll find out soon enough eventually. And yeah. But anyways, again, it's going to be it for this episode. So until next time, keep on gaming. There's a distance between us it's getting hard to reach out Haven't seen you in seasons But all I hear is your voice I know my limits
you can break me down, but I'll stay till the finish line. And I've been counting minutes for quite some time now, just to see you again.